Hey Jake with BH, and today we're taking a look at Hive Lighting and their new cosmetic presets for skin tones found in the Hive Antenna app. We're going to be in the studio today testing out some of the new presets along with some other colorful presets and a few fun lighting modifiers, so let's check them out. We'll be pairing three Hornet 200 CX lights with a combination of cosmetic and artificial presets. While the Hive Antenna app already features over 100 plus presets, the new cosmetic presets are designed to render accurate and pleasing skin tones using Hive's Omnicolor LED technology. Omnicolor multi-chip LED arrays use a combination of secondary and tertiary colored LEDs to create a more complete and even spectrum than traditional RGBW lights. The Hornet 200 CX can create 12,000 lumens of point source light with no flicker at any frame rate, which is equivalent to a 700 to 1000 watt incandescent bulb. The 200 CX features a very high CRI of 98 and a TLCI of 97, so the color reproduction will be extremely accurate. It has a 100 millimeter diameter, so it is fully compatible with hundreds of light modifiers, including Profoto's large selection of light shaping tools. We're going to be using a combination of Profoto softboxes along with a few of Hive's own modifiers, such as the Mini Leco and Flood Reflector, to create some unique looks. The Hive Antenna app is extremely important because it's the control center for all your CX Hive lights. The back of the 200 CX has no direct controls for intensity or color, so the app is a must have in order to make changes to its output. Once you're in the Antenna app and synced up to your lights via Bluetooth, you can start making changes. We created groups to easily select which light we'd like to control and make changes to just those lights. When in colors mode, you can make all kinds of changes to the light, such as intensity, color temperature, tint, saturation, and hue. You can even calibrate the light based on the type of shooting you're doing, such as photo or cinema. Switching to the sources mode brings up a comprehensive list of natural, artificial, and corrective color presets for all kinds of applications. Under the corrective tab, there are 12 new cosmetic presets, which are broken into three distinct categories, cool, neutral, and warm. There is cool amber, cool bronze, cool rose, cool violet, neutral amber, neutral bronze, neutral rose, neutral violet, warm amber, warm bronze, warm rose, and warm violet. Each of these presets allows you to find the most flattering light based on your subject's unique skin tone. For our model, we found cool rose to be quite flattering, so we all set our 200CX lights to cool rose and captured some nice portraits. We then had some fun with our modifiers, like the Mini Leco, to cut the light into different shapes. We also chose different colors under the Artificial Preset tab, like Amber Caution, and the Blue Glow Stick, to quickly create deeply saturated images. In only a few hours, we were able to create a variety of different looks and moods by just dialing in the app. Working with the 200CX lights was fast and easy. The body is streamlined and everything can be controlled via the clean and simple app interface. The body is made of anodized aluminum and feels very durable. The stand mount is detachable so it's easy to slide forwards or backwards on the light depending on your setup and where you'd like it to be. On the back of the light, there are two enhanced antennas for Bluetooth, DMX in and out ports for changing lights together, a 24 volt DC input, a quarter 20 mounting point, and an on and off switch. With control of the light fully in the app, you want to make sure the device you're using is powered up and you'll have enough backup power to last the duration of your shoot. Keep in mind that only the CX lights require full control through the app. The C line of Hive lights feature full controls on the back of the lights. The light weighs 2.2 pounds and measures 8.7 inches by 3.9 inches. Well, our time with the Hive Hornet 200CX lights has come to an end. We had a great time diving deep into the presets in the app and discovering all the options that Hive has given its users. There really is no limit to the type of light you can create. We were able to quickly choose our desired looks, add our modifiers, and get to work. What are your thoughts about the Hive lighting in their new cosmetic presets? Let me know in the comments below. I'm Jake with B&H. Just keep rolling.